Brooklyn Nets versus Milwaukee Bucks is a very disappointing series. Currently, Brooklyn Nets are up on the series 2-0. They're missing James Harden. And they just won by 39 points. The final score was 125 for Brooklyn to 86 for Milwaukee. Let that sink in. In game two of what was supposed to be one of the best series of the year, you lost by 39 points. This is the team that has the two-time MVP, Giannis Antetokounmpo, who I think is an absolutely dominant player, absolutely dominant, however, has had playoff disappointments over the last two years and is looking like, once again, they're not going to be able to win in the playoffs, and that's where greatness is made. You could be a great regular season player, but if you want to be one of the best players of all time, you got to perform in the playoffs. All right? Got Chuck, Charles Barkley, one of the best power forwards. He's not considered a top 10, top 15 player because he doesn't have that ring. John Stockton, Malone, they don't have that championship. Giannis is seeking that championship. He's still very young. It can happen at any time in his, year, in his career. I know he's a dominant player. I know he's that dude. But it just doesn't seem like Milwaukee can do it for whatever reason. Uh, Brooklyn Nets got great performances from everyone. Joe Harris, Bruce Brown, Blake Griffin, Mike James, Landry Shamit. Everyone, everyone, everyone for Brooklyn was absolutely performing up to snuff. And Milwaukee Milwaukee couldn't do it. Giannis had 18 and 11, only played 30 minutes because, I mean, third quarter and it was over, all right? It was over after the first. Brooklyn was up 17 points by the end of the first quarter. And then they just extended that to be up 24 by the end of the second quarter. Ah, that's this ain't a series, y'all. This is, this is a 1-2-3 Cancun. Milwaukee is going to go home. Uh, I think I think I think they can win game three, but they're going home in five. There's no way they go past five, and I would not be surprised if they get swept. Um, uh, I don't know what I don't know what Milwaukee needs to be honest. Do they need a they need a guard? It's, it's just it's incredible because Chris Middleton and Drew Holiday are great guards. I mean they're not they're not Damian Lillard. They're not the top. Five, ten guards in the league, but they're they're all stars. They're very good, a uh, point guard and shooting guard combo. It's just it's I don't know. I don't know why Giannis can't win in Milwaukee. I do not know. Does he have to leave? I doubt he's gonna leave. He just signed a max. But that's a wrap on that series. There's there is no way Milwaukee wins this series. Yeah, I'm calling it in five. Brooklyn's gonna win in five. Milwaukee wins game three. Brooklyn picks it back up for game four and five, and it's a wrap. This is all happening without James Harden, by the way. Who would have thought? I would have never.